The National Park, this is a lake. This was a uh, forest fire about 50 miles west of the west entrance to the Glacier National Park, which they had closed the west entrance after I got in there. Also rode the highway to the sun up to the top. I think we were the last year that road was open. This is Glacier National Park. This is some more of Glacier National Park. That's with my dog Scooter. And this video was taken with an old 35mm Panasonic camera, which wasn't the best in the world. That's the only thing I had at the time. That's my old dog Scooter. Here's a highway to the British Columbia. We were heading to Prince Rupert, British Columbia to get on a ferry to travel up to uh, Haines, Alaska. The lake in this video, part of the video is Lake Louise in British Columbia. This is a park I uh, was camped out. Most of the time I did camp out it was in a van. So we camped out next to the river this, this night. And it was really, really beautiful there. Too bad the video isn't as good as I'd like it to be, but that's the best I can get it. Um, had to worry about Scooter going into the river. There's a river where all the salmon are jumping, and I ain't no joke. I'm gonna pull the salmon out of here. It's big as me. That's where I got my ticket. There's a totem pole. I'm raining tomorrow. I'm gonna have to charge the battery to get me. This deer was uh, in somebody's front yard. It was a buck, and it was like a residential area. It was really kind of comical to see a, a buck eating their eating their lawn. This is where we spent the night before we got on the ferry, Scooter and I. And this is a museum we went through Prince Rupert. Uh, shows some of the 
history of uh, Prince River, British Columbia, the fishing and the different uh, ways people make their money up there. This was inside the ferry. As we're going up the inside passageway, we stopped at all the ports along the inside passageway all the way to Haines, Alaska. And this was kind of a long trip. It took about three and a half, four days. But it was very scenic, very educational. This was done on, the, on a ferry. I took my van with me. And we had some real beautiful scenery, saw some whales. This is a ragal. Stopped there for about an hour. And it was early in the morning. Tell by the lights and then it was about five in the morning and we left about six. It's a little scooter, he made the whole trip. Saw another dog, he didn't know what to do. <laughs>
are just pictures of the uh, rainbows and some of the scenery in the video is not really good. We got a few rainbows and, and we had some whale, whale watching, but it couldn't focus real good with the camera I had. There was a whole school of whales there. And we watched them for probably two or three hours. Here's some video of the inside of the ferry where they had a cafeteria where you can sit there and eat your lunch or breakfast or whatever and watch the inside passageway go by where there are all the scenery. It's really a nice, nice trip. This is Peril Strait inside passageway. It gets real narrow, and they had to go real slow. They don't make too much of a wake. But it was the, the bad weather they uh, have. A, it's real, very dangerous. We made it to the capital, Juneau. We stayed for about oh an hour, and then they blow the horn. You know, you got to get back on it. Next stop was Haines, uh, Alaska. That's where we got off. And it's where me and Scooter got off. <laughs> the water changed color. That was glacier water coming down out of the, out of the mountain. And the water turned like a greenish color. This is our last stop on the ferry. This was Haines, Alaska. It was early in the morning. And uh, this is where we got off, and I'll do part two.